Hello, I'm back. Uh, this time I am going to be filming you a real-time video showing you my skincare routine currently. Um, I'm going to go through each product that I use, how I use it and when I use it. I don't use all of these products every time, but I'll kind of explain how it works as I go. Um, so I have all my makeup on now just from my general day and I'm going to show you how I take it off and keep my skin clear. So first of all, I always double cleanse. So I'm gonna use my um, Declior Micellar Cleansing Oil first. So it just goes onto my dry hands. Two pumps, just rub it together. Massage all over my whole face on top of the makeup. Things may start to get quite messy when I rub it over my eyes. So, this is how I look when it's rinsed off. Yes, my skin goes red. It tends to be very sensitive if anything rubs on it. But yes, so. As you can see, we are left with a bit of mascara, which is fine because I have put my normal cotton discs, they're all wet. I make them damp and then I squeeze them out underneath the tap um, and then I massage over my eyes to make sure that I get off all the remaining mascara and eyeliner. have a couple of these ready. Awesome. She's makeup free. Okay, so next, I said double cleanse. So I now wash my face with my Declure um, three in one cleanser so this is like a face wash um, but to use that I use it on my um, W7 electric cleanser which looks like this so I just get this damp under the tap and then I squirt my face wash onto it like so it's on there and then there's two speeds, if you press it once, it goes quite slow. If you press it again, it goes a bit quicker. So, we'll do it slow first. So this foams up nicely on here. I do quite like it, a bit quicker so we'll turn it up. That's better. I hope you can still see. So I go over my whole face and neck. With this, obviously it's foaming up because the um, brush was wet first. All over. So enough of that, then obviously I rinse that out and now I'm just gonna rinse my face. Hold on. So that was my double cleanse. You don't have to double cleanse, but for me, I just really like it. Make sure I get all my makeup off and I just feel much cleaner and I tend to stay, step, touch wood, spot free. Um, so I just stick to what what is good for me. The next thing I do is I get another one of my cotton rounds and I just go over it with my Declior tonifying lotion. Um, so I literally just pour this on the cotton pad and then wipe over to make sure that I've removed all of my makeup, as you can see. Still a little bit on there. Okay, so that is all gone. So normally, just every day now, I would then use my oil and moisturizer. 
um, but I thought I might as well just show you everything that I do um, once a week. So now I, once a week, I use a, an exfoliator. Um, so I always use the Declior Phyto Peel exfoliator. So this is a exfoliator without um, microbeads. So you just, it just looks like a white cream. So it comes out like that. And then you just apply it to your face, a bit like a face mask. And then it dries like a face mask does. So you just have to leave it on a minute or so to dry. So this helps remove any dead skin build up and once you've removed it, it makes your skin super, super soft. Okay, so while that is drying, I exfoliate my lips. I, that may sound really weird, but I get such dry lips um, and when I wear lip stick or liquid lipstick it tends to catch so I exfoliate my lips loads more than once a week actually um, so I use this little W7 lip exfoliator um, it's really really good it's just called lip crush it smells so yummy it says that it's supposed to smell like bubble gum but to me it smells like banana so I just rub this can you see it's got like quite a grainy texture. Uh, I just rub it all over my lips and then I massage it in with my fingers. And this just takes off all the dead skin. And my lips are super soft and then I just remove that with my cotton pads. I can now feel that this phyto peel has um, started to dry. Can you see? It's kind of gone kind of crusty. Um, and then you, can you see? I'm just waiting for the camera. It peels. Can you see here? You literally just rub it and it all starts to peel off all your dead skin. It literally just rubs off and takes all your dead skin with it, which is great. It's a good idea to do it over the sink. I'll just see. But yes, it does make my face go a little bit red just because I'm rubbing it. And I'm quite sensitive, but it doesn't hurt or sting. I'm just going to rinse the reminder off. I'll be back. Okay. So, just rinse my face. Make sure the rest of it has gone. Then I just nip over my face again with the toner. Um, to just make sure that's super clean. And that all the exfoliator is gone. Okay. So now that my face is a little bit damp, which I quite like because I quite like it to be damp before I put my moisturising products on. So I use the Declior Neroli essential oil first as my serum. It's an oil serum. Um, so I use this every day underneath my day cream or night cream. So you just put a little bit on, just need a tiny, tiny bit. Just kind of apply that. It goes further 
if your skin is damp as well, which is a good tip. Um, but I use the Neroli one because I'm quite dehydrated and dry. They do loads of different types, so if you're super oily, um, there's a really good one you can use um, oily and, for oily and blemished skin, or really good one for super dry skin, or mature skin, whatever skin type you have, they have one for you. I also put some on my neck as well, looking super greasy. That's fine. Okay, I usually use a Declior um, moisturizer, but I have run out, sadly. Um, so I am just using a tester from the shop. So this is a Chanel Le Lift cream. So it's a nice rich cream um, that is a anti-aging cream, which you can never start too early. Um, I have started using anti-aging cream because I want to be preventative, um, but yeah, it's a nice texture, um, and it's called Chanel Le Lift. It smells really yummy too. But yes, usually I use the Declure Hydrofloral Rich Cream um, because I love it. It's natural. It's really good for my skin, um, and it works for me. Moisturizer on. And yes, I would wear that much moisturiser and oil underneath my makeup because I'm dehydrated. The next thing I'm going to use is my, I just have a little sample here, Declior um, Eye Cream. Um, so this is the, can you see it's kind of yellow in colour. This is a, just a mini sample of the Aroma Lease Eye Cream. It's yellow in colour because the yellow pigments um, counteract any dark purple kind of pigments that you get around your eyes and I just pat that in. I don't put it right here because I don't want to get puffy eyes. I just go around the edge of the eye bone, the orbital bone and just pat that on. So that is my complete skincare routine. Um, I don't do the exfoliation every week, uh, every day. I do it every week or twice a week depending on what I think I need. I don't do the lip exfoliator every single day, um, but I do it kind of two times a week. And I do add in a face mask um, once a week as well, but I thought that might be a bit boring for you to watch. But if you do want me to go through the type of face mask that I use, um, then just comment below and I will go through it with you. I hope you enjoyed my skincare routine. I hope it wasn't too long. Um, yeah, if you have any questions, just ask me in the comments below and I will answer them for you. Thank you.